Previously on Gears. We used to protect Cox settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? The short version? The cop is on his way. You promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with a the fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. <laughs> Look, you know as well as I do that he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Dad, you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the car. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. We need to get through that fort to the abandoned Osborne line on the other side. And locust bodies in there after the war. If your swarms related to the grubs, we'll find out there.
is not ready for this. She can barely keep her eyes open. Don't worry about her. She'll be ready. Okay, we're almost to Fair's coordinates. Welcome to Azura. time you slept last night got a good eight or nine minutes in nightmares does it get better it gets tolerable I mean, control. And we're already breaking it up them as it is. What Jin doesn't know won't hurt her. This is my call, all right? If the First Minister doesn't like it, she can yell at me. Which she almost certainly will. Tell us where to go, Control. I'll do my best. But remember, no one's been in that facility for like 25 years. Yeah, that's pretty evident. You're not there to buy a timeshare. You're there to launch an old Hammer of Dawn prototype. And your intel says one of the silos is still intact, right? Yeah, as far as they can tell. Just get Dave to a functional control room. He'll handle the launch sequence. Burial site in this island. We're hatched, could be waist deep in swarm. <sighs> this is one hell of a way to come back to it. Hey, get back! Oh shit! What the hell? Uh, I need to search a place that's falling apart. Quickly. Guys plan to launch a satellite from here? It seems a little half baked. Well, half-baked plans are kind of Baird's specialty. How Baird even figured out they had a hammer satellite here? My father? Before he died, he let Baird in on a few cog secrets. And this island, it has plenty of them. Hey, over there. Could be useful. Dave, fetch. <laughs> There'd still be bodies. Only a handful of us made it off Azura alive. <sighs> Got 
Gotta cut through. Okay, let's go. Get back! We're coming down! Guess who? Dave, send a pulse and let's see what we're dealing with. How do you want? Ah, there they are. silos. Assuming the swarm haven't ripped them all apart. Hey, I think we can get down this way. Let's just find a silo. For the record, you don't seem okay. I'll live. There's too many active hives. Everywhere we go, another burial site's hatched. All the more reason to get the hammer of dawn online. Let's hope Jin sees it that way. on this island. When we get this hammer satellite up, we can do it again. That's the idea, old pal. Control out. So, straight's not an option. How much rocket base is even left? Let's find out. You guys go right, Marcus and I will go left. We'll find those silos. Sounds good. We stay in contact. You sure about this? Two silos, two paths. You got a better idea? Yo, hatch! 
Come down. This looks like some kind of an exhaust tunnel. But is it from a silo? Only one way to find out. Turn this place into a hive. Let them. It's an isolated island, hundreds of miles from shore. Uh huh. Let's just make sure that happens after we leave. <laughs> See, Dave gets it. Okay, let's find that silo. <laughs> so much for a silo.
Secure the area. The other's with us. Let's go. Acknowledge. Nope. Locked. We'll have to find another way to open it. Dave, check that pen. relate to our mission? It doesn't, but now I need to know. I'm guessing whatever's missing was pulled from the network. Well, who'd have the authority to do that? Back then, uh, only the facility commander. Find his office and poke around. Okay. We'll go. Scanning immediate area. Detecting all inferior pod technology. <laughs> oh, come on now. That's just me. something here. Oh! <laughs> 
Target down. Ah, there. Done. Now let's find that office. What does a facility commander's office even look like? Oh, I don't know. I think a big door, nameplate, maybe commander written on it. That's, that's a fair response. Del, commander's office is through here. This door is locked. Nice one, Dave. All right, commander's office. Let's look around. Safe. Good place for secret data. Gotcha. Hey, Control. Good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all over us. Oh, shit. We're on our way. Is that rocket attack? It is, believe it or not. Good. Then find a port for Dave to plug into. If it checks out, he'll initiate the launch. It's all yours. Control, you're in. Start the launch sequence. Pressurized. First stage. Opening silo doors. Error. Error. Uh, Error. Delta, we have an issue. The silo hatch. It's not opening. Oh, of course. I knew that seemed too easy. Baird, options. Bug out. Blast doors aren't going to protect you from an exploding rocket. All right, then we call it. Let's go. Hydraulic external power to on. No. We get that hatch open. What? Kid, listen to your old man. You got to get out of there. Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition test commence. Good luck with that. Well, let's get that hatch open. So what's our plan? I don't know. There's gotta be a manual override near the top. Find our way up. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. 
for extraction. How about I see Jen first? I'll calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix being diplomatic? You can call her what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary. And you know it. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? 
Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay, um... Yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Come on, Dave. That was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. Yeah, I'm... I'm sorry. The thing is... You two are more alike than either of you want to admit. The data is in front of you, Damon. What? what? That's it? I thought the new satellite would automatically link to the old ones. It cannot find them. Without regular scheduling from telecommand, tracking accuracy <gasps> degrades. Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your words' literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually thanking Please stop me. talking. So, I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, that data drive you wanted. Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Ah, uh, what's wrong with Dave? Dave had a few problems. What kind of problems? Hmm, uh, that kind. Oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. <sighs> Everyone, meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's different about him? All new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Uh -huh. And... And he's... all yours. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Damon, there are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. More sarcasm to add to your growing library. Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. Did I succeed? <sighs> Follow me. You'll want to equip this new module ASAP. It'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna dig this. It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Over here. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. Now this will do. Iris, activate Alpha 331. Certainly, do. So, say you've got a target that seems awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate. See what happens. Flash! All right, finish it. Test sequence complete. Huh, that could be useful. Now let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Reloading. Pulse. Reload commencing. Jack Black. Gotcha. Commencing reload. Pulse. Reload initiated. Take the targets 
required. Back. Nice work. Feel free to run it again if you want. Test sequence complete. No offense, JD, but uh, Jack's my new best friend. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. What Damon means to say is that he has more important things to do. Thank you, Iris. Bluntness is one of Iris's more commendable traits. I wonder where she gets that from. Later, Baird. Come on, guys. No worries. Do your thing. Come on! Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. Yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work, punching machines. And sparring. Hang on a second, shit stick. Shit stick? Del, theories? I don't know. Maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick used to stir up shit. All right, fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? <laughs> you want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is gonna leave me at a distinct disadvantage. Then again, maybe not. Hilarious. Are you in or not? Oh, I'm in. Come on, man. Let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this will be fun. Oh, son of a... How's that fun working out for you? Try it again, Foss. Come on. Hey, here's the thing, Foss. The bottle spar with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming, but explain. Shit, it's false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? No, I'm good. Jin does love her golden boys. But never for very long. See, that was fun. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Fa's fun time's over, can we go find that component? I'm done this day. It's not even noon yet. <laughs> Ah, there's the component we're borrowing. Or stealing. I prefer borrowing. Indefinitely. All right, let's see what it does. I say, I'm loving the new Jack. Can't wait to test them out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. We still have to go to Jen's office. Yeah, Dad's probably had enough alone time with her by now. Man, Foss left his locker open. <laughs> Where's a stink bomb when you need one? Could get used to the field of viewing those things. <sighs> okay, come on, enough's enough. You gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jen.
Let me be perfectly clear. When it comes to this weapon, I don't share your optimism. It's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism. Yes, well, I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online. I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that, for both our sakes. Anya would have wanted you, you to- You don't get to talk about her. If that's what you think, I won't argue. You and that goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son and mine. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. Oh. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? She should be buried here, you know, with the Allfathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister, Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Send them in. Ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means, explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah, that'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Please, slow down. Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it. Go. 